Hello, Tennessee Valley. You are now tuned to the do-over. Your hair makes me want to give more. Your lips are something I'll care for. Your eyes are so hypnotizing. And your size is so redefined. <laughs> know that we are the show that improves, empowers, and entertains you through the fabulous world of hair, fashion, and makeup. I'm Ashley Ann, and today we're going to be highlighting domestic violence and how you or may know someone that can be helped today. So let's take a moment to meet this week's guest. I'm Trudy Simpson. I'm a 35-year-old mother of four, and I'm a domestic violence survivor. I was in a relationship for 10 years. Um, saw signs early on that it was an abusive relationship or something we're controlling. But at the time, I was blinded and thought that was love. Um, early in the relationship, maybe a year after, I entered Safe Place for the first time, only staying a few weeks. Um, the abuser convinced me that we were just having problems and I went back home. Um, shortly after then, it got to where the verbal abuse started and in front of the children and and I just knew, hey, I made a big mistake. Um, I still stuck in there trying to hold my family together. It got um, to a point to where um, black eyes and chipped teeth to where I was having to hide from family, hide from my friends, miss work. Um, to actually at the time I didn't know it, but I was actually protecting the abuser. I mean, you have a big heart. At the time, I had a big heart. I didn't want to hurt anybody, but I was the one being hurt. And it finally came to the point where I figured I had to stand up for myself. So one day after getting off work, I mean, I walked in the house and tension was already high already. I don't know if he, what was going on, but I caught the rail. Um, I tried to just go in and um, lay down, but that didn't work. When I woke up, it was a pillow over my face, and I could barely breathe. And I knew the end I had to leave. So I left, and I um, I went to Safe Place, and I stayed for almost a year. I mean, I think that's probably as long as anybody been there, but I needed it. I had to heal myself, and that, that's what I had to learn while I was there. You have to heal yourself, because long, if you don't heal, if I didn't heal myself, then I would have kept putting up with the music. And I'm, I'm so grateful for them through counseling classes. I mean, there's a lot of stories that I heard that were worse, way worse than mine, but to me, I had I had to make a change for myself and stand up. To anyone that even suspects that their relationship is not the ideal relationship or what love is supposed to be. I mean, you, you can tell from, from early on um, different signs that you can watch for. It, I mean, abusers are normally, they want to um, keep up with your every move and it's not, they don't have much trust in women at all. Another, um, friends, they want to keep you from your friends, your family, from having a social life, from even little things as getting your hair done or buying new clothes. They assume that it's for somebody else. Those are scary signs that, you know, you gotta, you gotta get out of it because anybody that loves you wants you, you know, to be the best you can be. So I advise you to get out of it as soon as possible because they do not change. You have to change yourself. That's that's the key to living a better life. You gotta want better for yourself because they don't want better for you. I am Inga. I'm the owner of Inga's Lashes and More Salon, number one in Florence and also number two in Sheffield, Alabama. And my tip for today with eyelashes is start off with a natural look. If you wear natural makeup, don't do heavy eyelashes because they don't coincide. If you wear heavy makeup, then you have your lashes. But make sure your lashes always complement your makeup. You don't want one to overpower the other. That's my tip for today. How big is the biggest beer selection in Alabama? 
It's over 1,100 beers in stock. And it's all at Liquor Express and Craft Beer Store. That's all your favorite brands, local and specialty craft beers. Get kegs and over 65 beers on tap. Then discover the wine room with a variety to please even the most distinctive taste. All this and top shelf favorites too. Liquor Express and Craft Beer Store, your one-stop party shop at the corner of Church and Pratt in Huntsville. Now that we've met this week's gift, now let's take a moment to hear from the duo for team. My name is Corey, and I'll be Trudy's hairstylist today. Hello, my name is Kendra. I am the owner of Fancy Fab Addictions Boutique in Florence, Alabama, located in Fort Lane Shopping Center, and I will be Trudy's fashion stylist today. Hello, I'm Monday Hill, and today I'll be Trudy's makeup artist. Hi, I'm Victoria, and this is my mom, Suki. Today she'll be doing Trudy's eyebrow threading and her henna tattoo. Hello, I'm Inga Harden, owner of Inga's Lashes and More Salon 1 and 2 in Florence, Alabama, located at 413 East Tennessee Street, downtown Florence, and I will be coordinating, directing Trudy's makeover today. Now that we've met the do-over team, now let's see what they have in store for Trudy. Okay, ladies, what my salon is going to do today is we're going to give Trudy a cut. We're going to give her a mohawk cut because right now her hair is just kind of full and we're going to get her back to the look that she likes and that's that mohawk trendy creative edgy right. look and um, I'm going to do her lashes today make her eyes just pop take 10 mm -hmm. years off her eyes make her face all smooth and prettier mm -hmm. than right. what it is and then I'm going to have um, my henna tattoo artist from India awesome. looking yeah okay. she's going to put some henna tattoo Exciting. on her hands and um, this, that's to celebrate life again. And it's a culture uh, technique that they do back in India. So we're bringing that to the state here in my salon. Then we're going to thread her eyebrows. No wax, no razor. Right. We're doing the threading, the Indian technique. And um, we'll do her lashes and make them pop. And we're going to do uh, her haircut. And what are you going to do for it today? Well, I'm thinking about some color. Oh, okay. Um, I believe that color brings back life. Um, and I'm also thinking about some golds, you know. I thought about the song, Living My Life Like It's Gold, and okay. I believe it's our time to shine. So right. I'm thinking about maybe a one piece, some golds, and a little color. Yeah. Just to make her shine a little bit. That's kind of like Okay, I'm really feeling the Hannah tattoos and the color. So what I'm going to do is play along with the Indian art. Okay. I'm going to give her like a rabbit kind of look on her eyes and mm -hmm. a popping lip color. So All right. I'm really excited I'm about excited. this. I'm excited. I am too, y'all. We're about to do this. <laughs> yeah, We're about to have her <laughs> looking like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Up in England? Okay. And then down in Kendra's? It's yes. like, what's going on? What's I'm going ready. Down? Hi, I'm Kendra from Fancy Fab Addictions Boutique, located at 877 Florence Boulevard in Florence, Alabama. Today, my fashion tip for you it would be to keep it cute, simple, and classy. As women, it's nothing wrong with keeping it simple. Too much can make you look bad. And that's my fashion tip for today. Welcome to Inga's Lashes and More. Give yourself the VIP experience. Have fun, look beautiful. Come in today and get 10% off all our services. Inga's Lashes and more. 413 East Tennessee in Florence. It's Image, it's everything. Put your image into high gear with Tut Zone Photography. Hot, professional, gorgeous. Beautiful, you image. Leave your image to Tut Zone Photography. Indulge your imagination with creative concepts, professional quality, and all work done on time to your satisfaction. Treat your memories to the quality they need. Call 256 683 2610 or online at tutzonephotography.com. A photography, videography, and multimedia company, Touch Zone Photography. 
Just how big is the biggest beer selection in Alabama? It's over 1,100 beers in stock. And it's all at Liquor Express and Craft Beer Store. That's all your favorite brands, local and specialty craft beers. Get kegs and over 65 beers on tap. Then discover the wine room with a variety to please even the most distinctive taste. All this and top shelf favorites too. Liquor Express and Craft Beer Store, your one-stop party shop at the corner of Church and Pratt in Huntsville. What's up, Tennessee Valley? It's your girl, Tiff, from Duo Hair and Fashions and the Duo Over Makeover Show. Join me and my girls every Saturday night at 12 on the Valley CW as we bring you the hottest makeovers featuring hair, fashions, and events from around the city. Follow us for more information. Work. Trudy is having her hair cut and shaped by none other than Corey in the salon. He's taking her hair and molding it into a nice shape with his clippers, and then he's going to give her a nice edgy look, an outline look, real sharp and crispy to define her haircut. I never go with her, she don't do her hair no more And you don't get no kiss if it's a bush down there Girl, I should see nothing but nook it when I look down there They come and get with me, shout out what better to do He call me that how you doing, tell him better than you Yeah, I'm kicked back with four pieces like a Kit Kat Me hitting if you ain't a dime, just forget that Pretty flat out, and she don't have And one of these, well, I think I pass I just handed her the key to a new dry jam And she'll go she into the threading room And, and Slicky would thread her eyebrows really nice and pretty and pretty Size. and Suki is from India so we have the authentic Indian threader in the salon and she threads the eyebrows removing the hair with no wax no chemicals no heat and it just the hair stays gone longer and it looks real smooth and clean very pretty shape and after she threads her eyebrows then Suki would give her a henna tattoo on her hand and the henna tattoo represents celebration Usually it's done during marriage, wedding parties, and birthday parties, and just anything to celebrate. And today we're celebrating Trudy's new life, her coming back into herself again. So right now we're doing the Hannah tattooing, and she's doing the threading, and just making her very pretty and pampered in the threading room. And then from there, we'll go into the eyelashes. I doing her eyelashes, applying each lash one at a time so no mascara is needed, no curling is needed, and the lashes will stay on for two weeks. After that, we'll fill her lashes in one lash at a time again, and it just looks very beautiful. Her eyes will pop, and then it takes 10 years off of her eyes, so she's going to look very rejuvenated, very life going, very happy, very upbeat. And then I started with a natural look, but after I saw, after seeing this haircut, that Corey is doing, I had to give her some more eyelashes to pop and to be more outstanding to accent the, the haircut. So right now, Trudy is just being made over at Inga's downtown Florence and just making her beautiful, happy, rejuvenated, and a new person again. So the Hannah Tattoo is doing his thing today, representing celebration and a new life at Inga's. Thanks for coming to us. My name is Rachel Cavanis, and I'm the Executive Director for Safe Place, an organization committed to helping those who are battered by the person who is supposed to love them. 
Domestic violence comes in many forms, from physical to psychological and emotional. Safe Place provides the services and tools necessary to help people change their lives. If you or someone you know is involved in an unsafe relationship, please call the helpline number below or visit us online at nwalsafeplace.org. Welcome to Inga's Lashes and More. Give yourself the VIP experience. Have fun, look beautiful. Come in today and get 10% off all our services. Inga's Lashes and More, 413 East Tennessee in Florence. And we're back, and I'm here with Rachel Cabinets, who um, is going to talk to us a little bit about Safe Place. So thank you so much for allowing the do-over to come in and speak with you today. So Rachel, if you don't mind, tell me or tell me about your organization, Safe Place. Sure. Safe Place is a comprehensive domestic violence program. We serve six counties in northwest Alabama, and we serve about 3,500 people a year. Um, and that doesn't even count the number of people who call us on our helpline. So we, we do that. We have um, safe shelter. We have long-term housing where people can live rent fee free for up to 18 months while they get back on their feet. Um, we have court advocates who are in the courts that help people um, walk their way through the criminal justice system and uh, to seek protection from abuse orders. Uh, we also have a, a uh, prevention education program for children um, all the way up through teenagers. And we have a 24-hour uh, helpline that is confidential and it can be anonymous if someone wants to but that's really the way that people can contact us and start to plan their escape. Wow. Such a blessing um, to be able to provide that type of service for someone. Well, Rachel, again, thank you so much for allowing the do-over to come in here and speak with you. It's such an honor and I wish your, you and your organization the, the most. Thank you. Thank you. You're awesome. <laughs> All right, ladies, stop putting Chief and Betty Weave in your head. Do you not know this can damage your real hair and will not achieve the lasting look you desire? Well, it's now time for you to step up to 100% human hair by Hush. No tangle, no shedding, and available in a Brazilian, Malaysian, or Peruvian origin. All wave patterns and colors in up to 40 inches in length. Hush hair is now found exclusively at Dual Hair and Fashions on Highway 72 in Madison. The beauty bar on Jordan Lane in Huntsville and online at HushHairInc.com. Welcome to Inga's Lashes and More. Give yourself the VIP experience. Have fun, look beautiful. Come in today and get 10% off all our services. Inga's Lashes and More, 413 East Tennessee in Florence. What's up, Tennessee Valley? It's your girl, Tiff, from Duo Hair and Fashion and the Duo Over Makeover Show. Join me and my girls every Saturday night at 12 on the Valley CW as we bring you the hottest makeovers featuring hair, fashions, and events from around the city. Follow us for more information. Work, work. Today I decided to put Trudy in a one-piece jumper um, because it's simple and classy. I decided to go with some fall colors uh, to tone things down because of her skin tone. So I decided to go with some burgundy, um, some rust colors, and gold jewelry. Um, I love color and I believe that when you're coming out, color is beautiful. We are women of color. also decided to do the gold accessories, um, as I stated earlier, because we're living our life like it's golden. Today was an awesome experience. Um, this makeover really puts uh, an end to all the hard times that I had. It, um, it's bringing me back out, you know, to be the truly that I used to be before all this happened. Um, I really want to thank the staff down at Inga's, her entire crew, she has an awesome crew, um, the barber, Corey, Suki, the henna tattoos, the eye thread, did an awesome job, pain free, I thought it was going to hurt, but it didn't. Um, my outfit from Fancy Fab Addictions, Ms. Kendra dressed me to a T from head to toe, accessories and all, and I can't forget the wonderful makeup artist Monday, um, out of Huntsville, Alabama, she did a wonderful job. Um, I just want to thank them all for taking the time out. I love you. Okay, so Tiff, what do you think about our makeover candidate for this month? Well, we told our viewers that to expect something different from the do-over this season, so we actually did a salon in Florence, Alabama this time, so I'm totally excited about this. That's what's up. You should be. Yeah. Your show is moving a little, little further now, so yeah. hey, that's exciting. Yeah. So um, we did um, Inga's Lashes and More. 
the lady that she nominated was Trudy, which was a domestic violence victim. And we'd have been there, done that. Don't I mean, nobody have time for that. I know. Let's just break it down. Let me let me get comfortable with it on there. Sorry. We're gonna yeah. get like 100 on that issue. Ain't nobody got time for nobody be putting their hands on nobody dang darn birth. No. So hey. No. But she got a chance to go to this place called Safe Place, right. which actually nominated Trudy. Because as you know, we always do somebody that has some type of issue, right. whether it's cancer survivor, um, tornado victim, and this just happened to be a domestic violence victim. So we were glad to kind of put, you know, bring the do over to Inga and get her all the way back right, you know? So okay. Safe Place is the place to just get their lives back together so that they can kind of move forward. And so she can kind of stay away from the crazy food and put his hands yes. on it. Okay, Especially okay. that. Okay, so, okay. Yeah. Much so, understood. Corey was the guy. We gave her a mohawk. Okay. He decided to cut her up. I'm talking about Well, now I was wondering who's putting popping. that crisp edge on and gave her that steam harvest. She, she, <laughs> she actually had a mohawk, but it was so classy. Right. And um, Monday, we took our own Monday down there because Inga didn't have a makeup Artist. So that's cool. We had Monday on deck. She put it, the beat she on always her. comes through. Yeah, she <laughs> always flawless. Yep. Now Inga did do her lashes. Yeah. Because she kind of specializes in lashes. Okay. So the boutique was uh, Fab, Fab Addiction. Yeah. And um, so she had a lot she of did. Pants yeah. Her pants was real nice. Yeah. Very, very, very on point for the fall, for the weather. Yeah. You know what's coming up. Yeah. Made her look very awesome. Something she can. Wear to dinner, she can wear to church, she can yeah. even wear to work or yeah. something like that. But she looked really good. She um, did. I can I say that the team did a great job. Yeah, they did a great job. I think if, if job. her guy, the, her ex was to see her, he'd just be like, Why? Just why? Like, Ugh. Yeah. Why did I oh. do it? You know, that regret would really set in because she was looking hot. Yeah, you always got to give him something, you know, kind of soccer punch him back in the stomach, you know, mm -hmm. got a good punch him. You know? She was looking real hot. Yeah, she looked real good. So, so um, ladies, if you know somebody that you want to nominate for a makeover that has an issue that you feel like just deserves a makeover. As you can see, we travel, so we don't have to just have anyone from this area. If you know a salon that wants to feature, be a feature on the do-over, just hit us up and let us know. And just whatever salon wants to be featured, hey, nominate you someone. Yes. It's really just advertisements. We'll come out to tell you the truth. <laughs> we'll pull up. We'll pull up on you. <laughs> so this brings us to the Tosh and Tiff segment of the show, and we actually have a question. And when I read this question, I was just like, oh my goodness. But um, we try to have a relatable question to the topic. So, of course, we have this girl, and her name is Micah. And Micah says, Dear Tasha Tiff, I am recently involved in a relationship where with each argument, it becomes more and more aggressive. Is this signs of domestic abuse or is this just typical relationship issues? And it gets aggressive and aggressive as it goes on. Mm -hmm. Girl, get you a place to stay. Go to your yeah, mom and go somewhere just because it, it gets worse from that point. When they start showing you that crazy side, right. they got to go. You got to go because <laughs> it, it doesn't get any better. And it's like every little simple thing that you do is going to irritate them mm -hmm. to where they always got to have some reason to just snap off. So and if hey, this is not something and, or someone that you see long term, like somebody that you're going to be having and children And when he marriage, say he love you and he got to put his hands on you, that is not love. It's not. It's not. Do not hit me and tell me you love me. And it's not anything to take lightly either. You know, a lot of times we sweep little arguments under the rug or we just ignore it. But people really do get hurt in these situations. And I don't know if you have kids or not, but you don't want to set these examples for your kids. And you just and, don't um, want to be in this situation yourself. You're beautiful. I don't know what you look like, but I'm sure you're beautiful. And no matter what, you deserve better than that. So I say run. So don't forget to send your questions, comments, anything that you want to holler at us about to our Facebook page. We read them. We answer them. Just go on Facebook. Look up the Do Over Makeover Show. Check us out online at doobieover.com. And make sure y'all watch us every Saturday and Sunday at 12 Midnight on the Dallas CW. <laughs> and midnight though. <laughs> and midnight though. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. See you next week. All right, North Alabama. Now it's time for the Valley Spotlight. Try to contain Cause even before the creation of man He knew me by name 
that's why when I sit up thing I go all out, yes sir, I do my thing I scream, I shout, he's blessed me so much and in so many ways Way too much to withhold my breath I know that you wanna praise him Fine. <laughs>